Hello everyone. Today we will learn about an important concept in geometry. This is about perimeter and area of different shapes. We will learn what is a perimeter, how to calculate perimeter of basic shapes with examples. Second part will cover the concept of area. That is, what is area and how to calculate area of basic shapes. Perimeter It is the total length of the whole boundary of a shape. Perimeter is the distance around two-dimensional shapes. In other words, it is the measurement of the distance around something. The total length of the boundary. It is a length, so it's measured in meter, centimeter and kilometer. To calculate the perimeter of a shape, we calculate the sum of all sides of the shape and the result is called the perimeter. Let's calculate the perimeters of a circle, square, a rectangle and a triangle. Circle the circumference is the perimeter of a circle. The formula to calculate the circumference is Perimeter of a circle P is equals to 2 pi r where r is the length of radius of circle and pi is whose value is 3.14 is equal to 2 multiplied by 3.14 multiplied by 15 assuming r is equal to 15 centimeter which is equal to 94.2 centimeter Therefore, the perimeter of this circle is 94.2 cm. Square Let's name each side of the square A. Since a square has all equal sides, so the formula for the perimeter would be like this. Perimeter of a square is equal to sum of all sides equal to A plus A plus A plus A or is equal to 4 multiplied by A units. Assuming A is equal to 12 cm is equal to 4 multiplied by 12 cm is equal to 48 cm. So, the perimeter of a square which has 12 cm long, each side is 48 cm. Rectangle Now, let's move on to the rectangle. A rectangle has 4 sides and the opposite sides are equal in length. The longer sides are known as length L and shorter ones 
are known as width w therefore the formula to calculate its perimeter would be perimeter of a rectangle is equal to sum of all sides is equal to l plus l plus w plus w or 2 multiplied by l plus 2 multiplied by w or 2 multiplied by l plus w units assuming l is equal to 12 cm and w is equal to 6 cm is equal to 2 multiplied by 12 plus 6 cm is equal to 2 multiplied by 18 cm which is equal to 36 cm hence the perimeter of a rectangle which has 12 cm length and 6 cm width of its sides is 36 cm triangle now we will see how to find out the perimeter of a triangle a triangle has 3 sides we can name each side a b and c to make the formula for calculation thus the formula for triangle's perimeter would be perimeter of a triangle is equal to sum of all sides is equal to a plus b plus c units assuming a is equal to 12 cm b is equal to 10 cm and c is equal to 8 cm is equal to 12 plus 10 plus 8 cm is equal to 30 cm therefore a triangle with different lengths of the sides that is 12 cm 10 cm and 8 cm has a perimeter of 30 cm area an area is the surface encompassed by a shape the area is measured in squares therefore the units are written in square that is Centimeter square, meter square, etc. Let's see the formula for measuring the area of various shapes, including a circle, square, a rectangle, a triangle. area of circle is equal to pi r square where pi is 3.14 and r is radius of circle is equal to 3.14 multiplied by 15 square 
is equal to 3.14 multiplied by 225 is equal to 706.5 cm square. The area of this circle is 706.5 cm square. Square. Now let's see the square that has four equal sides. Since all four sides of a square have equal length, we will refer to all of them as length L in the formula. Area of a square is equal to L multiplied by L multiplied by L multiplied by L unit 2 or is equal to 4 multiplied by L unit 2 is equal to 4 multiplied by 12 assuming L is equal to 12 cm which is equal to 48 cm square so the area of this square is 48 cm square rectangle now let's measure the area of the rectangle which has four sides where opposite sides are equal to each other. This green colored part inside the shape is the area of the rectangle. Like the perimeter, we will use the size of all four sides to measure the area of the rectangle. However, Instead of adding their sizes, we will multiply them. Also, in perimeter, the unit is written as it is. But, in area, the unit is squared. So, the formula considering the longer sides as length L and shorter one as width W will be area of a rectangle is L multiplied by W unit square is equal to 12 multiplied by 6 assuming L is equal to 12 centimeter and W is equal to 6 cm which is equal to 72 cm square. Therefore, the area of the rectangle that you see is 72 cm square. Triangle A triangle has three sides. This horizontal line at the bottom of the triangle is called the base B while the distance between the baseline and the top of the triangle when measured in a straight line is height H. The formula for calculating the area of a triangle is area of a triangle is equal to B multiplied by H divided by 2 units square is equal to 8 multiplied by 12 divided by 2 assuming B is equal to 8 centimeter and H is equal to 12 centimeter 
is equal to 96 divided by 2 which is equal to 48 centimeters square. Hence, the area of this triangle is 48 centimeters square. We hope now you have learned about perimeter and area. If some concepts are not clear, then replay the video again and again. Still, if you have some questions, then ask your teacher. Also, it is highly recommended to solve relevant questions from your textbook pertaining to the concept of perimeter and area.